Hi, I'm Pilot Robert back again and today I'm gonna show you and today I'm gonna show you my dream came true it's hiding in this box that it's been sitting on a shelf for about one year because I didn't have the crucial ingredient for this but that ingredient came to me from Texas USA a few days ago and so now we will take a look what's hiding inside this box it's probably as you can see from this writing ASP it's an engine nitro engine but not just an engine it's a dream of all Erze pilots every pilot want to have one like this someday I've been dreaming of a Moki 400 cubic centimeters but for now I think that this engine will do the job and now let's look what's inside even the box is nice well it should be for this amount of money probably you can already imagine what's inside because I have here five glow plugs this is everything that come inside the box when you buy this engine and now also for the mounting of the engine let's take it out this beauty oh it's quite heavy now let's take out very carefully and take the first look of this masterpiece and here it is ASP five cylinder radial engine A look from behind from a side I can tell you what feeling this is to hold an engine like this in your hand. I will put this engine on Westland Lysander 3 meter wingspan aircraft from Second World War. It's a high wing plane because I don't want to risk an engine like this on a low wing plane for the first time for the first takeoff for the first feeling of a radial engine and the first sound maybe later I will 
put this engine or maybe another on a I don't know Thunderbolt razor back or something like this but for the start I will put this on like I said Lysander Westland 3 meter wing span You get these plugs. You get these plugs with the with an engine. If you make your own onboard glow, but I bought this. I will show you exactly for this engine. I got the Sullivan onboard glow, five cylinder glow for I don't know what cost, maybe $80. So that I will be sure that all cylinders are working in the air when I'm in the air with the plane. Because I heard that sometimes the trouble can be that the lowest cylinders are not working when you're in the air. So an onboard low and everything will be okay. Now I will show you the propeller that I will put on this engine it's a three blade BL propeller it will look very handsome on this engine you can probably imagine what a joy it will be to start this and now for my crucial ingredient that I've been telling about let me put this here to the side I will show you this this is what I got from Texas USA everyone who's been familiar with this engine probably know you probably know what's inside but for the others let me show you ta -da! it's an original Keleo exhaust system for ASP five cylinder blow engine. Just for you viewers, I will take this out so you can see what the exhaust looks like. You could make your own at home, but I don't think that the sound will be as good as from this exhaust because if you spend this kind of money for engine I don't think it's a problem to spend a little more for the right exhaust and so that you can get the best sound from the engine Because when you're on the ground, when you're on the ground, <coughs> it's the looks that matters. But when you're in the air, the exhaust is the thrilling bit. It will go something like this. Now you have to take these tubes out and 
mount this exhaust on the engine. I think that well, you can see already it will fit perfectly on the engine. So this is it my fellow pilots. I was so excited that I had to show this to you. Because I didn't so much videos of the engine taken out the box on the YouTube. So, this is it. This is all you need. The engine, the exhaust, the onboard glow, and of course, the right propeller. Okay, this is it for this video. And the next video, it will be the first start of the engine and listen to the sound of radial five-cylinder engine.